Hallelujah. Thank you once again for tuning in to Embassy of God Ministries to listen to the super natural word for the day. Well, today is Monday, April 5th, 2021. And Pastor Dennis Amos Amajong, my spiritual father, says that you are risen with Christ. You are risen with Christ. Our opening scripture is taken from the book of Colossians, chapter 3, verse 1. It reads, If then you are risen with Christ, seek those things which are above, where Christ is, sitting at the right hand of God. Pastor Dennis says, The resurrection of Jesus Christ is the foundation of the Christian faith. Without the resurrection, the belief in God saving grace and mercy through Jesus is void. When Jesus rose from the dead, he proved his divinity as the Son of God and his works of atonement, redemption, reconciliation, and salvation. Pastor Dennis continues to say, When Jesus died on the cross, in the mind of justice, the entire world died with him because he died for all men. However, Christianity didn't start from his death, but from his resurrection. When God raised Jesus from the dead, you were raised together with him, and you became a new creation, alive to God. Hallelujah! Pastor Dennis continues to say, The Bible says, Jesus is seated at the right hand of God. This means he has authority over all creation over all of heaven and earth God has lifted us up into glory along with Christ we sit with him in the heavenly realms of power dominion and majesty you can see that in the book of Ephesians chapter 2 verse 6 we occupy the same position of authority with the power of attorney to act in his stead glory to Jesus our meditation scriptures we have only one meditation scripture today which is from the book of Colossians chapter 3 verse 1 to verse 3 it reads if then you are raised with Christ seek those things which are above where Christ is sitting at the right hand of God set your mind on things above not on things on the earth for you died and your life is hidden with Christ and God. Our one-year Bible study plan. Today, please make it a point to read Deuteronomy chapter 9 and chapter 10 and Psalms 99 to 101. Now it is time for the prophetic declaration. We will say it together. Please raise up your hands. What an outstanding privilege to sit together with Christ in the place of power, far above all principality and power and might and dominion and every name, not only in this world, but also in that which is to come. I function from a place of glory, power, authority and dominion separated from the debilitating effects of sin corruption and darkness in Jesus name Amen come on begin to speak in tongues as you affirm those words Manta ya baba de boshi ya baba mako shata ya ndaya Manta ya baba de boshi ya nda mako shata ya I thank you father for I am risen with Christ in Jesus' name, amen. Shalom.